So the Earth Management book is an effort to sort of step back from the confusion of today and say, what does it take uh, to manage the, the whole Earth as one community, to get away from this society of consumption and, and money and return to the spiritual roots of being human in harmony with nature. So we wanted to put together a, a book that would explain what is possible and particularly to find in the past and most specifically in Korea's culture, traditional culture and spirituality, uh, a possible solution to what seems the greatest crisis uh, that we've ever seen. So the essential message is uh, that we can find the answer uh, to the problems of the world within ourselves. That by controlling our own thinking, our, the way our brain functions, and through practice, controlling our, our breathing and our, and our behavior and going through the practice of, of yoga and other uh, uh, daily activities, that we can change the way that we behave and then change the way we think and find a way for humans uh, to survive to interact with nature in a harmonious way uh, that will not be destructive. But the important point about this book, the idea of earth management, is that it's not some abstract high level to say we need a new president or a new policy, but rather that the change has to start with us uh, from our daily lives and how we see ourselves, how we breathe, how we organize our thinking, the practices, and that, I think, is why the book is so significant. Well, I think the book is relevant for everybody, uh, but I think the first person would be somebody who feels the real need. They see a world in which the environment is being destroyed, in which people don't care about people anymore, in which they're only seeking out money or some abstract uh, things they can possess, and they want to get away from that broken system and return to a spiritual wholeness with nature and with fellow humans. So if you feel that way, if you have that concern, then I recommend this book because it will give you some of the first steps uh, to head in that direction and to find that the answer to the problem is not out there with some special person, but it's inside yourself. And I think that was the whole purpose uh, for us in writing the book, was to say, we can show you a direction, but the real answer to the problem is inside of yourself. So one of the critical parts of this book is the idea of Hongik philosophy or spirit. And this is from traditional Korean teachings and the, uh, the, the Taoist, Confucian, and Buddhist traditions of Korea down to the present, this uniquely Korean idea that one should uh, live for the sake of the community, for others, that the benefits of the world should be shared by everybody, and that we live in an ecosystem and in a human community uh, in which we have to care about others. So the answer to our problems, in a way, is to say, uh, not by trying to solve my problems at all, but by trying to solve everybody's problems. By caring about other people is the way that one can solve one's own uh, uh, problems. The only answer to this, to this crisis that we face as a civilization, right, is when we stop thinking about ourselves and start thinking about the community. And I think that Korean tradition of Hongi goes back far into the past, but it's extremely relevant for us right now and in the future as we try and create a new civilization. So this book is written for anybody, uh, but I want to encourage especially young people, people uh, who are in college, in high school, or younger, who really are starting to think about how will we deal with the world that we're confronted with? How can I find stability and meaning in my life? 
So I really want to encourage young people to read this book and to think about this question about how I can find a solution to the problems that seem to come from outside, inside of myself, and how this idea of hongik, of caring about others as a way of solving one's own problems, uh, can help me to find direction and to find a solution to problems which seem to have no solution at all.